Mr. Lewis, with Jim, my question is, um, what should black people be doing every day if we want to stop being treated like worthless creatures? Follow the code. That's why I wrote the code book. Just pick out whatever problem you're having, because every day you have some type of problem. I'm assuming that, if you're black. So you just look in the code book and see what the code book says about what you do about that problem. That's why I wrote the book. It's supposed to be helping to solve a problem. The problem, according to the book, is connected with racism that causes the problem. So it helps you, helps any person who is a victim of racism to solve whatever problem they might be having, whatever day it happens to be, and the nature of the problem. The book is segmented in the nine areas of activity, economics, education, entertainment, labor, law, politics. Politics means any interaction you have with people, whether they're white or non-white. That's what politics is. If it, if it involves people, that's politics. If you are asked, are you in politics? The answer is yes. Why? Because I talk to people. I'm involved with people. I, I, I buy things from people. I, you know, I, I travel in the presence of people. I, I'm, I'm a people person. I'm in connection with people. Any connection you have with a person makes you a politician, according to what? Logic. That's what politics is, this interaction with people, any kind of interaction. Every person who has an interaction with just one person is a politician. If you ask, are you a politician? The answer is yes. See, it's knowing how to answer questions and know how to ask questions and what questions to ask. That's in the code book. That's why I say, go to the code book. That's why it's written. And go to this program that you're on now and try to get answers to questions. All problems are solved according to logic. All problems are solved through the process of questions and answers. Exactly. That's how you do it, sir. Questions and answers every day. 